it's Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here to help you make healthy living easy, fun, and delicious. And today I wanna to talk about meal prep and meal prep specifically with sweet potatoes because sweet potatoes are number one, super delicious, but they're also really high in fiber, lower in the glycemic index than regular potatoes, and they're really high in vitamin A and vitamin C as well. So the three recipes I wanna share with you today are all with sweet potatoes, like I said. The first is with baked sweet potatoes, and you're gonna turn these into Mexicali bowls. So they kind of have this Mexican component, but they're also drizzled with a little zesty tahini dressing. And then the second recipe is for a nine by 13 pan of a enchilada bake, and this is with tortillas, sweet potatoes, black beans, cheese. It is ooey gooey delicious. I think that you're gonna really love this and families love it too. And then the last recipe is for my kale and sweet potato chickpea brown rice bowls. And with this recipe, you kind of build all your components, put it into a bowl and top it with this like delicious peanut butter sauce, which let's be honest, best part. And so those three recipes, all meal preppable, all healthy, all delicious, vegetarian. Let's hop right in. I'm gonna show you how to make all three of these. To get started with the Mexicali baked sweet potatoes, you're gonna to wanna to bake your sweet potatoes at 400 degrees for about an hour. While the potatoes are baking, you can make the zesty tahini dressing by adding tahini, apple cider vinegar, lemon juice, liquid aminos, nutritional yeast, and garlic into your blender and blend until smooth. After that, you're going to want to saute your veggies, so onions, mushrooms, peppers, add those all to a skillet and cook until soft, about three minutes or so, and then add your baby spinach in and cook until it's just wilted, then remove the veggies from the heat. At this point is when you're gonna plan, put everything together. So you'll have your baked sweet potatoes, cut those open, mash each side and sprinkle on a little sea salt and pepper, and then load on the rest of the toppings. You'll have the sauteed onion and spinach mixture, black beans, tomatoes, avocado, spring onion, and cilantro. And then drizzle on the desired amount of the zesty tahini dressing. Of course, if you're gonna meal prep this recipe, you can bake the sweet potatoes in advance and make the dressing in advance and also cook up the veggie mixture in advance and just reheat everything right before you serve it. Next up, let's do the sweet potato black bean enchilada bake. To get started, you're gonna to wanna to make your enchilada sauce by adding roasted tomatoes, chili powder, cumin, oregano, cinnamon, cayenne pepper, and sea salt into your blender and blend until smooth. Then grab a large skillet, add avocado oil, onion and garlic and saute until fragrant about three minutes. Add your jalapeno and sweet potatoes in there, cover and cook for 12 to 15 minutes or until the sweet potatoes are tender. Then add black beans and baby spinach, toss everything to combine and remove the veggies from heat. Grab a nine by 13 baking dish, lightly grease the bottom and start laying ingredients for the bake. Place four tortillas on the bottom of the dish, add a third of the enchilada sauce, half of the black bean sweet potato mixture and half of the cheese, and then keep layering until you run out of ingredients. Bake uncovered at 425 for about 20 minutes or until the top layer of cheese is melted. At this point, you can serve right away, or if you're doing it for meal prep, you will just let the whole bake cool and cover it up and put it in the fridge and then reheat it whenever you wanna serve. Top with a little avocado, cilantro, green onion, maybe a little Greek yogurt or sour cream, and there you go. Lastly, let's make the kale and sweet potato brown rice bowls. To get started with this one, you just wanna roast your sweet potatoes for about 30 minutes. This step is best done ahead of time. Then you wanna cook your brown rice according to the package instructions. And then make your peanut sauce by blending all the sauce ingredients in a blender until smooth. This includes your peanut butter, garlic, fresh ginger, rice vinegar, low sodium tamari or soy sauce, maple syrup, and cayenne pepper if you like things a little spicy. Then you want to prepare your kale. You can do this by steaming it or blanching it or sauteing the kale if you'd rather. Once all your components are ready, you're ready to make the bowls. So you can prep all those things in advance and then just make the bowls when you wanna eat them. So you wanna put some brown rice on the bottom, then add some chickpeas and your kale, and then add a little bit of the sweet potato and then top it with as much peanut sauce as you like. This recipe is so delicious. It's one of my all time faves. So there you have it. Those are my three meal preppable sweet potato recipes. I hope you love this video. Let me know if you try any of the recipes below in the comments. As always, hit like, hit subscribe. I come out with a new video all related to healthy living every Tuesday. So I'll see you next Tuesday. Ding, ding, ding. Sweet potato calling. Time to get healthy.